Swimming in. Not a lot in the way of splashes there. This guy's good. One, two, boom! Teeth in. Hey everyone, Thornton Smash here, and today we're going to be talking about the upcoming Tropic Island map, and is it going to save Apex Legends, especially with all the controversy with the pricing models, the locked bundles that we've been seeing with the Halloween event, and I'm going to cover that too, along with the teasers for the Tropic Island map, which you have not seen before. We also smashed past 70,000 subscribers, so thank you again, and in this video, we got to do another one for 7,000 Apex coins, so just make sure you're subscribed, you like, and leave a comment down below, and we'll pick another winner, and for the winner for yesterday's video, just look for your comment in this video and message me on the Discord link in the description below and we'll get you your prize. Okay guys, we're going to go over some never before seen teasers for the new Tropic Island map, but first I think it would be a huge disservice if we didn't talk about what was going on with this Halloween event because it's having a massive impact on Apex Legends to the point where a ton of posts are going up saying that they just want to straight up boycott this event. And the main reason for that is because unfortunately you cannot buy any of the new skins you want. You have to open these thematic packs, which I actually just went over the other day and I told everyone do not buy these wait till you can craft them because you could spend upwards of an entire collection event $160 to get the skin you want and you want to get an heirloom with it it isn't worth it to buy any of these skins and the problem stems even further say if you didn't want any of the new skins and you just wanted one of the old Halloween skins that's in the bundle well unfortunately if you own a core item such as in the Wraith bundle the triple take you can't buy any of the bundle whatsoever and there has been a lot of misinformation on whether or not this is actually the way that respawn wants to handle their bundles and the clear-cut answer is no Ryan K. Rigney let us know that it's due to a system limitation and that it will be fixed in season 11. But then why are you selling bundles when you know players can't acquire the items? Make them stand alone so players still have the option to do that. What made it even worse is when the Halloween event launched, there were actually no patch updates in the game, so none of the previous bugs got fixed. However, with the monster thematic event packs, there was a bug that allowed you to get better loot than you normally would. And Respawn went ahead and fixed that pretty much right away. However, with Watson, as you can clearly see, we've been dealing with the bug where her ultimate doesn't stop grenades at all, and they haven't done any fixes on that whatsoever. So it's really nice to see that they've got their eyes set on their monetary practices getting fixed as quickly as possible, while players still struggle with playing their main character. I apologize if I upset anyone that is a big fan of Respawn and EA and Apex Legends doing these practices, but honestly, I'm a little disheartened after seeing my favorite event of all time in Apex Legends being reduced to this. But now let's talk about whether the Tropic Island map and the teasers coming with it can save what this event has turned Apex Legends into. The teasers for the new Tropic Island map will be going live today and will last throughout the week. And obviously a lot of you have seen these images already, but now I will go ahead and show you where you will find these images. They will be on the control panel on the wall, just like you see right here. There is also something no one has seen yet, and it is a voice line from one of the characters that you will find in the pod, and it sounds like it's Bangalore. And I'm not gonna play the entire sound clip because I don't wanna spoil anything, but I will give a little bit of a teaser into what the new name of the map is called. Pressing immediate evac. Gaia. So that's going to be today's video. Let me know how you're feeling about the upcoming map and new stuff coming to the game and if it's going to save Apex Legends or if it's in a downward spiral and they really can't recover. And congratulations again to the winner of the Apex Coins. I'll give out that 7,000 again tomorrow. And until next time, Legends, keep slaying in the Outlands. See you out there.